Rat Boy is one of those movies that makes me happy to be a movie critic, because otherwise, how would I ever be able to find out what a boring movie could be made about such a great idea as somebody who is half rat and half human? You'd think there'd be fascinating possibilities there, but what they've done is take the least interesting things about being a rat and the least interesting things about being a human and put them together into one very boring, strange creature. You're going to need some publicity on him, and uh, you just might be the right one for the job after all. Mm -hmm. See, you can write a newspaper article on him. Uh, say, maybe uh, release a picture or two, you know, get the interest up. And then when they're busting down the door to get at him, we sell him to the highest bidder. That's Rat Boy right there, played by a woman, actually, an actress named S.L. Baird. And Sandra Locke plays the woman who discovers Rat Boy in a garbage dump in Los Angeles and finds that she can dress him up, but she can't take him anywhere. Sandra Locke's plan is to get Rat Boy under contract and make millions by selling the rights to television. But it turns out she's really not very good at that, and she apologizes to Rat Boy in one of the movie's more touching scenes. Water. Oh, oh. Back to the dump. Oh, oh, oh. It's okay. I brought you a present. I think you're going to like this. I've always liked it. It's like magic oh. actually a lot of work probably went into this movie and there's a fairly good performance there by S.L. Barrett as a person who is kind of not human and really not a rat it kind of reminded me of Jeff Bridges performance in Starman where he also had to learn to walk in a different way but this movie despite all of its potential is really uninteresting it doesn't really go anywhere doesn't involve us in rap boy and doesn't make us care I give it two stars and I'm Roger Ebert